how are you doing, Akalad? And you also welcome back to the channel with Green Drop Distance. And today we go to the final world, baby. Now the world that never was. I know, I think. This is part of the game I know, so I know everything that happens. You'll see nothing that happens in between. So I wanted to know what happened in Fantasia or something else appeared to solve for that matter, to be honest. Really? But, this is what I know. So, it's when your brain gets scrambled and confuddled and it's gonna be a real jolly now. It's gonna be a real jolly. Anyway, let's die with Sora. Let's go! Oh, literally, you again. Isn't this a world that never was? Is the organization's world sleeping too? No, it, it can't be. I know I definitely found the seven keyholes now already. The the seven so minutes. I've got to be awake again and in the real world. But why here? Oh, what's the matter, sleepyhead? <laughs> Who's there? Show yourself! We jumped through a lot of hoops to get you here. But it looks as if it's gonna pay off. <laughs> You're part of this? Hey, let's hit these plot points in order. Sora, Roxas. First, you must be wondering about your revised itinerary. Why am I here, not back home? The answer's simple. We brought you to this place. I jacked your little slumber party before it started, and ever since we've been both your companions and your constant guides. Before it started? Before it started. Oh, the man in the robe. And so that guy in the black coat. 
and Xemnas. Bingo. You were able to go back in time to just before your home became a sleeping world, only because a past version of you already existed there. And I can see, in the past, you already met Mr. Rogue Guy. The Rogue yep. Guy. He was there then to make sure you ended up here now. That's ridiculous. It sure is. It's too perfect. Who'd ever believe it? Which is why you idiots never saw it coming. You thought you were off doing some kind of test, right? Well, test this. How come you're wearing the same clothes if you're already back home? You are not gonna wake up, okay? Look, there's no real versus dreams anymore. There's this you, us, and this. I see. Fair enough. So what? At least I know who to blame for it. Ooh. I see you still got that angry look down. But here is where I tag out. I got just a few more hoops I gotta jump through. Come with me. Come on then. What? Pleasant dreams, kiddo. Dreams, kiddo. Let the old cow see old Jimmy Saddleby get them. Hey. Oh. Also, people that know this zone was born in Tessignola. It's his hometown, baby. He was a yes. stunted boy! This was where it started. At this point, I still had no idea that I was talking to myself. He cast away his bodily form just to set me on the appointed path. What do you mean? That is Xehanort, reduced to just a heart. The being you and your friends called Ansem. Oh! 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 Right before my world was swallowed by the darkness. To move through time, you must leave your body behind. Anson first sent me on my way, and then placed himself here when the time was right. That is what set all these events in motion. What are you saying? That he knew everything that would happen? No, not everything. But remember, Anson possessed Riku and saw his experiences in real time. So? That could only tell him so much. How did he know I would be here today? Simple. <sighs> Kyrie! You've been here many times. Your first journey, your voyage through memories, in the datascape, in your dreams, relived again and again. 
like deja vu. King Mickey? Oh. <sighs> Donald! Goofy! Now, I mean, watch out, do monster. The hell night. Hey. Pluto. Oh. And this. Where we drop. Don't know if I'm going to solve this part yet. Not at all. Yeah, thanks for that, all right, um, yeah, anything. I've got a feeling I need to get alright. Uh, alright then. Let's wake up a few children and do something. Let me drop him, boys! Uh, I'm not right to see him. Yep. Yep. Let's have a lap up, yeah. Let's go! Go, 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 go! Let's try to put up my body to up now, mate. Get a lot of that this time. Why am I here? I unlocked all seven keyholes, so I should be back in the world I came from. Oh, 
There we go. Now we're flaking, boy. Now we're flaking, 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 flaking. Let's go, my boy. Yeah, let's go into 
down there. Oh, I'll do them. Ow. Take it! Take it! Yeah! 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 I have to do it, but I might as well have to do it. Heal! I'm not going to use my bottom one for it. Yeah! Okay! Hey! Whoa! Where are they going in, eh? I think we've got some of the, uh, the boss. Yeah! Take this! Gotta wake up! Sora! You what's trapping him in that nightmare? Let's go for it. Cause if you are, I'm what nightmares fear. Yeah. 
kerajaan telah hilang tahun tunai. Kau kuat. Sora, don't chase the dreams. They'll lead you nowhere. Just to an abyss you'll never be able to wake up from. What? What's going on in Sora's world? Why won't he open his eyes? Is he still in the nightmare? That is right. Huh? Ansem! Sora could no longer wake up. No matter how many nightmares you consume, you cannot wake someone who has fallen into the chasm of dreams. What? Dreams hold our memories. Sleep holds our dreams. And darkness, it holds our sleep. Sora's heart belongs to the darkness now. Sora would never give in to the darkness! But you feel it, don't you? This world, the nightmare, the abyss. Why haven't you returned to the reality whence you came? No. This is a... Dream of a dream. A twofold nightmare. This whole journey. You have been inside Sora's dreams, and now darkness within darkness awaits you. The f what? No! I, I can't get loose! At the start of your test, when you struck out from that tiny island, you saw me there dressed in a robe. Immediately you knew something was wrong. So without even knowing it, you dove into Sora's dream. And you became exactly what that sigil on your back represents. A dream eater to protect Sora from nightmares. Me? I'm a dream eater? Correct. But you failed to protect him. 
After all your efforts to command the darkness and protect those you cherish, it is a shame you lock that power away in the end. Except... It's not over. Hey. I can still save Sora. No, so you can. understand what to do. Set the darkness in you free. And you can rescue your friend. Ansem. Or... Xehanort. You used to be a Keyblade wielder. But darkness stole your heart. And the Keyblade with it. Don't you see? That's half the reason I'm even on this journey. After allowing darkness into my heart, am I still fit to wield the Keyblade? Even after locking you away, here you are, haunting me again. So I get it now. There's no point in trying to hold the darkness back. At last, you see clearly. You know? When I look at you, there's this memory that flashes back. A secret I said I'd keep when I was little. The main reason I kept dreaming about seeing the outside world was because of him. My journey begins here. And now, I'm going back to the real world. And then to Sora's side. That is your answer? Yes. I know the way. Consume the darkness. Return it to light. You can try.
This ain't the first, this is the sec first stage though. Here comes the second stone. Be a real pain. Ansem! You're part of my heart now! Part of the light! Ever the fool boy! And forever! A pawn of the darkness!
strength to protect what matters. I finally make it out of the dream? Sora and I have been split up since the start of our journey. Because Ansem... No. Because Xehanort planned it. And that means... We're a long way off course from the Mark Mastery exam Yen Sid gave us. Alright. Sora's gotta be here. Somewhere. I'm probably going to end it here for next time on so we'll just go a bit further and just go, just go to sleep and work up a storm, so yeah. So, if you enjoyed this and one more, don't forget to like and one of the darkness and plus the like button, boys. Stay spooky. Toodles! Oh!